Hey everyone, welcome back to Effect For You channel. Today we are creating effect like this. So let's start it. As usual, first create a new composition. I am using 1920 by 1080 pixel 25 frame per second. Now drag your image into timeline. Scale down image if required. Now select the image and pre-comp them, and change the pre-comp name image 1. Double click to open image 1 comp. Now select rectangle tool, and create to outline around to the image. Now create a adjustment layer, then go to effect and preset panel and apply ram effect on adjustment layer. Change ram color which you like, I am just showing you example. Change the center point to top left corner and bottom right corner. Then change mode normal to overly. Now create a text layer and type any name as you like. Align the text layer. Then create a rectangle box around our text. Then select text layer and make a mask equal to the box. Open text layer go to animate and select position and tracking. Go to first frame and add keyframe, and change the tracking amount around 85. Go to few frame forward and change tracking amount 0. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now create a new text layer for extra elements. I am using X so it's look like cross. Duplicate this X2 time. Select all three X and change the opacity 50%. Then press S for scaling and scale down a little bit. Now hold and press Alt and click on stopwatch for expression, and type wiggle parentheses 5, comma, 30 parentheses. This expression give to our X let a little bit movement. Apply the same expression for all X letter. Now create a new white solid layer. Go to 5 frame forward, and press Alt and right square brackets for trim layer. Go to the last frame of white solid layer. Press T for opacity and add a keyframe and change amount 100% to 0, then go to first frame and change amount 0 to 100%. Now select text layer and rectangle box layer and pre-comp them, so it's help us to change the text anytime. Our first slide has complete. Now select image 1 com. Go to first frame, press S for scaling and add a keyframe, and change amount 145%, then go to a few frame forward and change amount 100%, select both keyframe and easy ease them. Go to around 2 second and trim image 1 com player. Now, Go to project window select image 1 comp and duplicate them, drag image 2 comp into timeline, 
Also select text comp and duplicate them. Now open image 2 comp. Select text comp. Go to project window and select text 2 comp. Hold and press alt and drag text 2 comp over text comp layer so it's replaced with text 2 comp layer. Now we don't need this white solid layer anymore, so turn off them. Then select our image layer, and go to project window, hold out and drag image on our current image. So that it's replace this our second images. Now open text to comp. Turn of shape layer. Select text layer and open it. Delete mask we don't need anymore. Open text then go to animator 1. Then open range selector 1. Then advance and change shape square to ramp up. Then go to around 10 frame and add a keyframe on position. And move text down around 6340. Then go to few frame forward and change amount 0. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And change the text as you like. Duplicate the text layer, and move this layer below the first text layer. And scale the size, and change the opacity around 20%. You can adjust your animation anytime, if you think animation goes wrong. Perfect, it's look good to me. Now move image to comp player. Double click to open image to comp, and you can change the ramp color as you like. Now, go to main composition, select image 2 comp and move down. Then go to first frame of image 2 comp, and select both composition, hit P for position, and add a keyframe, then go to last frame for image 1 comp and move up. Select both keyframe, and easy ease them. Perfect. Now, Drag light leak footage into timeline, and adjust the light leak footage in between our transition. And change mode normal to screen. You can also on motion blur, so it's look more attractive. If you not found this, hit F4. Perfect. Now, go to 2 second forward, select image 2 comp, and hold alt and right square brackets for trim comp layer, then go to project window and duplicate image 2 comp, and drag into timeline. Also, duplicate text 2 comp. Open image 3 comp and select text 2 layer, do the same adjust as we do first 2 comp. I am skipping this part little faster so that the video does not make long. You can also experiment yourself, I can just show you the way. You can add something new to your own. I showed you, how to create an attractive modern opener, you can make it even better, by adding small elements in it.
hit zero for render. Thanks for watching, hope you like the video, if you like the video, hit like button, and subscribe our channel, for more tutorials, I'll see you the next video.